Salut chers amis Nous voilà posés à l'instant en Suède pour aller voler sur le Blackwing Turbo Donc euh, on en avait parlé lorsqu'on avait essayé la machine on s'était promis de venir en Suède avec un lecteur qui aurait répondu sympathiquement à ma sollicitation. Alors voilà, nous voilà à Landskrona. Dans grand beau, grand beau ciel bleu, grand soleil, on va aller essayer un Blackwing survitaminé, une version qu'on ne peut pas avoir en France. Et, et j'ai hâte. C'est parti C'est parti. Et toi alors Ah bah Dis moi, moi euh, d'abord j'ai apprécié des... 4 heures de vol dans un magnifique Moni pour arriver jusqu'ici, retrouver le soleil et voilà pouvoir essayer le 915 que je ne connais pas. Toi, tu ne connais pas non plus, euh, en tant voilà, même, même connais... en tant que distributeur, tu n'as pas jamais euh, eu la chance de voilà. voler dessus. Non, non, mais <rire> j'en ai commandé un, mais je n'ai pas encore essayé. <rire> oui, donc euh, confiance aveugle. Voilà, confiance aveugle. Non, non, mais je sais que ça. Ça vole, euh, ça vole certainement euh, bien plus rapidement que le 912, euh, avec les mêmes qualités que le 912, quoi. Donc, euh, je suis sûr que c'est génial, quoi. Voilà. So, can you tell us, uh, Niklas, a bit more about the, this aircraft? It's a world record uh, aircraft, is that correct? Yes, it is, and we also use it for the German certification. And which speed? Uh, we flew. Uh, we fly about 228 to uh, airspeed, maximum speed of this. Not. Airport. Yes. Ah, that's so not bad. No, it's not too bad. And uh, full power, full everything, and a yes, high. Yes, we're cheating. We're flying high. This high. engine is made for flying very high. But uh, we are one of the first manufacturers to try the E-prop, and we are okay. very happy with this propeller. It's uh, much lighter than the MT, and uh, the performance are the same or even better. So a guy like me is a nuisance for you. No, you... no problem. <laughs> Are you sure? Yes, okay. I'm sure. Uh, you are very nice. Okay, uh, so uh, Fabrice, you, you will be the first. So. Okay, uh, but you flew with Thierry's plane. Yeah. Okay, but I'll put you on the right, okay? Okay, or... no problem. I think uh, the French planes, they fly a little bit better because they are lighter. Okay. But this flies a little bit faster. So if you like speed, you pick Yeah, this you, you know, want. with the Mooney, of course, you like speed. Otherwise, uh, you, you, you fly your Cessna 182 like Emmanuel. But they, uh, the light, uh, the light French good? planes uh, with the 912 IS, they also fly really good. And you can short, you can land in less than 300 meters. Excellent. Uh, okay. In? Yes. You step here with the left foot. Okay. And then here, and then you have strong up here. Yes, go. Yeah. Right. Okay. We uh, I keep my shoes. Yeah, that's yeah. One. okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's only if you but climb in the back. Lane A, 2500 RPM. Okay. Take fuel pump. They're both working. Your pressure's in green. And in is good. Canopy is locked. Flap position is here. Flap position. Trim position, correct. 
control three and uh, instrument in red. We go. Last kilo now. Here, go back, back to the lining up for runway three zero. Check that nobody's coming. Last kilo now, Mike Delta taking off runway three zero. So you will feel when we reach about thirty knots, you will feel how the propeller is like grabbing the air. It's really a nice feeling. Now it's coming. We will have 2,000 feet per minute climb. Speeding control, feel a eco call over here. So you can feel how smooth the engine runs. Uh, it's like a turbine. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Bob Yankee. Now report to traffic. Delta. Select Mike, Mike Delta. Now report to traffic. QNH 1020. 1020. Good afternoon, Sunday 77 Tango. Climb the flight level 190 passing now 130. Sunday 77 Tango, hello, radar contact. Scan flight level 280 direct build around. Climb flight level 280 direct build around. Sunday 77 Tango. We then go at Meta Alpine 19 exit Delta Flight 180 coming 190 in Montalvo. Alpine 1. Alpine 1, Delta oh, is coming. Don't you worry. That's great. I think we will have more. Ça marche, hein? Bah, c'est fou. You did a great aircraft. Thank you. <laughs> oh, she's fast. She's coming yeah. more. She has more. More to, to give. Seventy-five percent. Okay. And the speed is one ninety-one knots. And the consumption is thirty liters, thirty-one liters. Uh, the best speed is sixty-five uh, percent. It's the most economic speed. The best. So you, that's what we recommend. But the best speed is full power, of course. You <laughs> <laughs> can never have enough power. <laughs> Yeah, we're done with the demo. I'm ready for descending to uh, my doctor. Yeah, descend outside the uh, Ingenhorn TMA and uh, then descend into uncontrolled airspace. Okay, we will descend outside of uh, Engelholm's control. See my uh, Hopefully it will be ready at least in one year. Hopefully at the end of the year. Okay. I will show you uh, that this airplane stalls just as good as uh, the other one. They all stole the same. So you can you can see the the clean stall speed is around 50, and here we. Uh, Again. 
We'll go down to round 42. Here we can take a one knot per second. And we can take one more. Normal landing configuration. I think we are, even with 45, it's the same. And uh, Sierra Lima Mike, we are standing by for one. Lima Mike, yeah, descend uh, 2,500 feet. Standing 2,500 feet, Lima Mike. So it's a, there she's starting to get a little yeah. bit more, but you can see the flap is crazy. You see outside? Yeah, I see. We have warnings if we get the flap, you have the flap speed. So here she's really quick. We're going to go next 466, we are on the side next to the front of the line and zero. Next 466, it's almost like a race car. Down front of the 250, next 466. You can make it a little bit. Are you feeling sick easily or no problem? No, no, it's okay. I want to fly aerobatics, but we can fly a little bit. Only 60 degree back. <laughs> so what is in more interesting is uh, your capacity to, uh, to make uh, strong, quick, uh, fast aircraft and, uh, and uh, to, uh, to have a, uh, an aircraft with a personality also. And uh, so this is very, very interesting. Yeah, but it's designed for myself. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's not level 280. Last Kona, Blackwing, my Delta uh, approaching from the west. Runway 30, you're in the pack. Uh, there's a plane there. See it? Hello, sir, Radio Yankee. We have the black wind inside. We are on the uh, crosswind turning downwind right now. I have you in sight. Uh, the Inga for them. To Echo and Snacker, 2051. Not going to see Echo Mike Mike does uh, left downwind runway 30. Alright, so here we slow down. We slow down to around 80. 1300 is the right pattern altitude. We take one flap. Make you feel how she slows down when she gets one flap. 33 Whiskey Romeo contacted the boy 124680. Take the gears. 124680, 33. Goodbye. Our black wings on that thing. Yeah, Black Wing. Uh, I don't know, I was flying at flight level 8 0. <laughs> 0 like that. Uh, plus 190, plus 5 seconds. He, he, he asked about the weather that we were flying. Uh. <laughs> so we fly here around 70, 75. And uh Greg Martin uh Martin Dorf with Five hundred. So we, we usually land with thirty five degrees, but we also have forty five if we want to make really steep approaches. I don't know if Alain showed you or Oh you do as you want. Oh you can make a, a, a deep uh, 
Gear is out. All the engine values look good. So we come in really high, you can see. Yeah, I can see it, yes, definitely. With the money, we would uh, overshoot. You see here, if I take full flap and I accelerate. We have a descent rate of 1500 feet per minute. We will still make it. With no slide? Without slide. I don't slide with 45, only with 35. You have to be uh, a little bit. You have to be a little bit. Uh, great. Great, 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 great. <laughs> so with 35 it's really v easy. Very impressive. But you have to be a little bit experienced pilot because you have less time in the flare. Uh, you did properly. Yeah, but I, uh, <laughs> I have flown this plane as well. I know, I'm <laughs> kidding. <laughs> Alors, raconte. Impressionnant. C'est-à-dire T'as pas eu peur petite bombe. Mmh, Juste avant. Non, ça a été. Juste avant, c'est-à-dire bon, C'est impressionnant, c'est des vitesses et des manœuvres que j'ai pas l'habitude de faire. Je suis pas pilote. Euh, j'ai vu un passage bas là. Ouais. Mais je vais pas filmer parce que j'étais au téléphone en train de faire autre chose. Ah, mais par raté. contre, je ne suis pas sûr que j'aurais filmé. Ouais. Tu vois, parce qu'il était vraiment bas là. Ouais. Ouais, bah, c'était Nicolas aux commandes, hein, évidemment. Mais, ouais, 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 mais impressionnant, impressionnant. Ouais. Ça réagit, euh, c'est une, une petite Ferrari. Ouais. Le mot était bien, bien choisi. C'est vraiment, vraiment une petite bombe. C'est très, très, très amusant. Ouais. Bon. Vous, avez, vous avez fait un peu de voltige Pas de la vraie voltige, mais ouais, 8 paresseux et des, des virages très grandes inclinaisons. Ouais. En tout cas, il va, être, euh, il va être certifié pour la, la voltige pour la, la voltige en, ici en Suède. T'arrives à marcher là Tout juste là. Hein. <rire> C'est ce que j'ai cru voir. Il fait bien chaud en plus. Mais euh, il ouais. faisait chaud là-dessous ah, Moi j'ai filmé le passage. Ouais. Ah, tu ah, l'as cool, vu ouais, Mais tu l'avais vu arriver ouais.